What's happening everyone? Thanks for tuning in to another episode of KNMRD Radio Stuff. My name is Mike. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up and share it and do all that other kind of YouTube stuff. Today we're going to be talking about solar. It is a beautiful, beautiful sunny day in Texas in January <laughs> and I'm wearing a t-shirt. I love it. Uh, it's the weekend of winter field day. It's about noon o'clock and uh, I just saw that Radiotity has a new 120 watt foldable solar panel. So I reached out to them and said, hey, can you send me one to take a look at and review? Because I love solar and batteries. And uh, they graciously sent me one to review. So let's take a look at it. It's a, it's a nice big foldable 120 watt solar panel. Got uh, all kinds of doodads and stuff inside of it. And uh, tell you right up front, so far I'm already impressed with the thing. So let's dive in. I'll show you uh, what you get. We'll hook it up to a battery and see what kind of current we can get out of it. And uh, wrap it up. So this is it. Nice foldable kind of briefcase style uh, solar panel from Raddy, which is Raddy Oddity's brand. And uh, got nice little clips here to keep it all closed. Uh, nice rubberized handle. On the back, we've got this zipper pouch to hold all of our goodies. And inside of this pouch, we get a few things. It comes with, uh, there's four carabiners. So you can like hang this from a tree or something or whatever you need to carabine. You've got some, uh, I'm not familiar with these connectors, but uh, they're used a lot in solar. I forget what they're called. Now, one thing I noticed though, you've got the females that are red and you've got the males that are black. And when I first took this out, I just connected the two together because I'm so used to power poles and uh, realized I'm going red, black, and red black so I basically just crossed the streams there and then under this uh, little jacket on the power pole if I could get it off the red wire is going into the black uh, power pole so actually the polarity is correct but uh, that's quite a big oversight so I don't know if I just got lucky or if they intentionally crossed the streams like that but Check your polarity if you buy this. Um, I have every intention of cutting these off as soon as I'm done making this video and putting power poles on it. So I, I just don't use these kind of connectors, but that is something to keep in mind. And it also has this wire lead that is hardwired to the panel with a barrel connector on here. I'll probably cut that off and put power poles as well, but they, they have this connector on because it's designed to plug into, uh, Radiotity has a little battery box, little portable solar generator kind of thing uh, that has this type of input for the charging. So I assume that's why they made it. And then we also have this little pack here that you can plug in uh, this, and there's a little barrel connector on this, as well as a USB type C, a, a USB QC 3.0, and a standard USB. So uh, quite versatile there. It's, it's really nice. And I've checked uh, the current draw from both of these uh, wires, from either this or plugging it into here, I, they're exactly the same, so it's not like one is more powerful or less powerful than the other. So you've got some options there. Another thing included with the panel that I forgot to mention a minute ago, you get all these adapters, all these little barrel adapters that uh, plug right into the cord that's inside of the panel in the bag. And I will go ahead and plug this in because that's the one I'm going to use today. And to fold it out, we just press these buttons and it unlocks. And we just fold it out. And we get four nice, beautiful panels. One really nice thing about this versus some of the other panels that are out there, this has three feet that come out of it to really stabilize it. Another one I have only has two. So, I mean, that alone is, is kind of a nice detail to have. So let's, let's get this set up facing the sun on this absolutely beautiful sunny Texas day. So it folds out real nice. Now let me plug this in. I'm going to I need to charge this 12 amp hour bioeno lithium iron phosphate battery that I have. So I'm going to plug it up and I'll show you the current that we're getting out of it. And uh, even in winter, 
uh, I've, I've already been impressed with this. You know, the sun's only probably about 45 degrees in the sky. It's, it's, not, it's not overhead by any means, but there's not a cloud in the sky, so it should be a great day for solar. So we've got our 12 amp hour battery, and I'm just gonna connect this watt meter to it so we can see what's going on. And then just this cheapo solar charge controller and our solar panel. We're off to the races. So 4.93 amps, I don't know if you can see it right off the bat. Getting some good current draw out of that baby. I'll show you. What's that, 4.9 amps we're getting out of it? Kinda hard to see there, but yeah. In winter, not that it's really winter in Texas, but the sun is lower in the sky in winter. So to have that much current draw out of the panel in winter is insane. That's awesome. So that's it guys, a quick look at the 120 watt solar panel from Raddy or Radioddity. Uh, I will leave a link in the description if you wanna pick one up. I really like this, I'm very impressed. Very, very impressed. I like the stability of the three different legs. It doesn't have uh, problems like folding in or uh, falling over or anything. It's been out for two days now here at the, at the hunting lease where I'm at and uh, I've had no problems with it whatsoever. Great current draw out of it even in winter, I love it. It's gonna keep my 30 amp hour bio battery charged up for winter field day here that's gonna start in about 45 minutes. So I'm very happy with it. And uh, yes, I definitely give it the K at MRD seal of approval. So guys, thanks so much for watching. I do appreciate each and every one of you. And we will see you again on another episode of K at MRD Radio Stuff. 73 guys.